This is Eric Postable with a Body Morph exclusive. I'm here with Angela Lee, who just won the figure Class B here at the 2015 inaugural Milwaukee Muscle Mayhem. How are you feeling right now? Feeling pretty good. That was a fun time. Definitely a different show here, venue as well. So now, where are you from? I'm from Dawson, Minnesota, but I actually live in Moorhead, Minnesota, right now. Okay. How long does that drive? Oh, I actually went home first. It was about almost three hours, and then from Dawson to here is about eight. So Woo. that was quite the little haul, I guess you could say. Yeah, I go to Minnesota quite a bit, and uh, I'm usually in the Minneapolis area, but uh, it's it's pretty. Yeah. Uh, there's a lot of space out there. Yeah, especially over by Fargo. You know, a bunch of bunch of land. Uh, yeah, you're you're way up. Else. You're way up northeast, uh, northwest, right? E you're almost or, in South Dakota or uh, North Dakota, rather. Yeah, Moorhead yeah. and Fargo are right next to each right, other. Because I can hear the accent. Oh. Do you get that a lot? Sometimes. I don't think I have an accent, but I know when I talk, especially if I talk fast, it gets... I'm going to try to get you talking fast in this interview then. I want to hear a little... I wanna, yeah, I want to yeah. hear some of that. Because I, cause I don't think I have an accent. And then up here, I was like, oh, you're from Chicago? I'm like, yeah, how do you know? Like, you have oh, such yeah. an accent. Oh. So. Yeah, no, whenever I talk to people, they know that I'm not from here, but they have no idea where. So, I mean, it's not that bad, but... Yeah, it's, it's noticeable. But it's, yeah. it's a good noticeable, so don't worry about it. Okay. Uh, so you've been competing a little while. I, uh, we talked backstage a little bit. You've done yeah. some shows. You did one in Arizona, you said. Yep. Um, and now coming into this show, do you kind of have a plan going forward? Are we getting ready for juniors? or? Um, I was. I kind of came into this one as, hey, it's brand new this year. Let's try it out. Let's see how things go. Um, I did a different peak week, so we're trying to like figure out what's best for my body. It's been, it's been interesting. The show was fun. I met a lot of random new people from another girl from Chicago and Tennessee like a bunch of people yeah. from everywhere came here and then I met a lot of amazing looking figure ladies that <laughs> they talked about junior nationals and stuff yeah. and it's like all praise to you because you look phenomenal so. yeah, I think this show uh, everyone kind of came into it the first year and it was so close to juniors I think figure especially bodybuilding but figure especially yeah. a lot of girls were getting ready and yeah. three weeks out they jumped in and it was a really stacked class yeah that's for sure figure was definitely full uh, some of the physique ladies look like amazing as yeah. well and a lot of experience the on the stage and that Especially oh, yeah. in, the, in the taller classes. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, older ladies in Masters that, like, for being... Masters 30, came out, I was like, I can't believe these women are 35 and 40 years old. 35 or 40 plus, and yeah. I was like, if I look like you when I'm 35, yeah. 40, I'll take it. Like, yeah. that's my No complaints. <laughs> no, not the, the overall winner's talking about her two kids, 11 and 6 and yeah, 11 and 7. I, I'll praise to her, because it's like, if you can prep and do this whole entire diet and training everything with kids yeah. so that's you know you're still amazing. young right yes I am only 23 yeah, so. so you got a long ways to go I got a long time what so. made you get into competing actually I just watched Olympia I think it was about uh, two years ago well I've watched it every year but it was about two years ago I was watching bikini and I was like oh my I could do that that's easy and then next thing I knew two weeks later I was prepping for my first show and I did bikini uh, last March and then this March, like I said, Arizona for figure, and then now this show for figure as well. So. Now, which you prefer, figure or bikini? Figure by far. Yeah, okay. I love it. I love it. <laughs> I like getting, I guess, judge based more on muscle than the sex appeal. Then bikini and yeah, We know what it is. It's TNA. Yeah. It's a TNA contest. We, we get it. Yeah, basically. Yeah, so. And plus, it's, it's like. It's easier to sell to the family and friends. Like, what are you doing with sticking your butt out? Right? Oh, yeah. They'd be like, um, like. I act grandparents, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, now does the whole family support what you're doing? Do they come oh, to the God, shows? Yeah. yeah, my actually my parents are here right now. Dad actually drove the whole entire way, like Dawson up here. So let's yeah, talk about, let's talk about that with with Dad and the 23 year old doing this whole thing. How, how does he, he feel about that? Mind no? actually. It, well, he probably comes to the show to see all the women, right? No, <laughs> I actually um I at Arizona show like between like you know uh, morning and pre judging. Mm -hmm. We were actually at the hotel, and Dad was like, yo, let's see if I can do this. And, like, he was doing flex-off poses, and then he would even be like, well, let's see your back. And I'd be like, all right, Dad, and I'll show him. And, like, even today, too, uh, getting ready for the morning show, he's like, all right. He's like, well, he's like, let me see your quads. And I was like, okay. And I went like that, and I was like, all right. I'm like, I think, I think we're doing good, you know. You think so, you're talking to Dad and do, like, a master's class? Oh, God. He, <laughs> he said that when he came into the hotel, actually, yesterday, when during check-ins, a lot of the competitor guys sitting around the couches, he said that they're all staring at him. And so he's in good shape then, right? Oh, yeah. He's actually, he, pro yeah, he's pretty, he's really athletic for, I guess, his age or being don't like. Don't say a, it. Don't say I it for won't. an old guy. Don't say it. <laughs> I won't. But, well, nobody ever gets. he watches this. Yeah, he probably will. So, <laughs> hi. <laughs> but, um, no, yeah, my parents support all this so much. Like, it's ridiculous. Like, I wouldn't be able to do half of this stuff without them. Actually, probably nothing. So, I mean, it's nice. And. I know even mom, like, she's she loves this stuff and, like, she loves that 
like how I've like I guess transformed or changed my body and adding muscle and she's like your dedication you know and they, I, I've helped them actually change their lifestyle too to be like more healthy and and dad's always like let's have pull up contest let's see if I can beat you and I'm like the family oh. Christmas parties are busting out the pull up contest bar probably something like, or actually well I live on a farm so we go out to my bar and I guarantee okay, he's like go. all right let's do this grab a rafter like, yeah we that's what he has we have a uh, little things hanging all the way down the line and. Yeah, that's how he does his pull-ups. So he, he always, when I first started for with bikini, that's when he's like, do you think he's like, I could do it more than you or whatever? And back in bikini, my back sure. wasn't as strong. So I was like, well, Dad, probably. But now I'm like, no. So he's like, I'll do pull-ups. So I'll, just, I'll just keep going. And he's just like, okay. Get in the house, you're grounded. <laughs> yeah, he's just like, oh, whatever, fine. But, yeah. Well, you look awesome. I definitely, and I love the hair. What do we call the hair? Because in the play-by-play, I said, I don't know what we call it. There's a oh, name for it, right? Right. It is, um... Of course, now I forget. Oh, I'm putting you on the spot now. Probably. I've actually had this for... I know the ombre and I know the peekaboos. I know the highlights. I just said I know what this is This would be a peekaboo. Is that kind of what it is? I think like so. Like an underroo or something, maybe? Underroo. That sounds like a very weird term, but let's just... I mean, you can make it an underroo, okay. whatever. We're, we're going to patent the name. Patent we're going to come name. up with something. Yeah, body morph pros. Yeah, it's, it's a body morph haircut. That. It was cute, though. I liked it. It was good. Yo, yeah, thanks. So. Well, hey, we'll let you get out of here. I know you want to go eat. I'm sure the family wants to get out of here as well. Yes. Uh, we'll let this young lady go. Angie, uh, she'll be competing here, hopefully, in the uh, near future. We'll see her then. Until then, this has been Eric Postaple, the Body Morph exclusive. We'll catch you guys back at the shows. Thank you so much. Yeah.